द गुड शेपर्ड हु लेज डाउन हिस लाइफ डियर फ्रेंड्स इन जीसस क्राइस्ट टूडे वी सेलिब्रेट द फोर्थ संडे ऑफ ईस्टर इट इज कॉल्ड गुड शेपर्ड संडे इट इज ऑल्सो द वर्ल्ड डे ऑफ प्रेयर फॉर ओकेशंस इन टूडेज रीडिंग्स we are reminded of the profound love and sacrifice of our lord jesus christ the good shepherd in today's gospel according to john jesus reveals himself as the good shepherd who lays down his life for his sheep his love for us is so great that he willingly sacrifices himself for our sake he knows each one of us by name and calls us to follow him and in following him we find true life and abundant joy the prophet isaiah used the symbol of a shepherd to describe the messiah in chapter 40 verse 11 he says he shall feed his flock like a shepherd he shall gather the lambs with his arm and carry them in his bosom and shall gently lead those that are with young we shall look at the four characteristics of the sheep sheep are known for their dependence on a shepherd for guidance protection and provision sheep are vulnerable creatures easily led astray and prone to danger sheep tend to follow their shepherd's voice sheep are social animals that thrive in the presence of others the shepherd also has four characteristics The shepherd is responsible for the safety of the sheep and willing to risk his life to defend them against predators. The shepherd leads his sheep to green pastures and still waters for nourishment and rest. The shepherd leads their flock and guides them to their destination. The shepherd cares deeply for his sheep, knowing each one individually. Jesus, the good shepherd, lays down his life for the sheep this is stated four times in today's gospel of john chapter 10 verses 11 15 17 and 18 there is something very personal and intentional about laying one's life down for another that means he lays down his life on behalf of the sheep for the sake of the sheep he dies so that they will live Jesus goes on to contrast himself with the hired hand. Unlike hired workers who lack a personal connection with the sheep and flee in times of danger, Jesus intimately knows his own and willingly lays down his life for them. Jesus exemplifies a profound love and commitment towards his sheep. That is his followers. Jesus the good shepherd knows his sheep. Jesus says, I know my own and my own know me, just as the Father knows me and I know the Father. The concept of to know someone speaks of a profound connection rooted in personal understanding and love. Jesus and his followers share a bond characterized by profound trust and closeness. Jesus recognizes each individual as someone for whom he made the ultimate sacrifice while they perceive him as their rescuer and closest companion just as sheep recognize the voice of their shepherd Jesus' followers recognize the voice of the one who nurtures guides and cherishes them The question we must ask ourselves is this Do I really know the good shepherd As we meditate on this shepherd imagery let us consider what it means for us today In a world often marked by uncertainty and turmoil Jesus stands as a constant and faithful shepherd who guides us through life's changes He knows each of us intimately calling us by name and leading us with gentle compassion yet being a follower of the good shepherd is not merely about receiving his care but also responding to his call just as sheep recognize the voice of their shepherd 
we are called to attune our hearts to the voice of Jesus amidst the noise of the world through prayer scripture and the sacraments we cultivate a deeper intimacy with our shepherd allowing him to guide our steps and shape our lives in the first reading from the acts of the apostles peter boldly proclaims the name of jesus before the rulers and the elders of the people filled with the holy spirit he fearlessly declares that there is no salvation in any other name but jesus This proclamation speaks to the centrality of Christ in our faith. We shall look for opportunities to imitate his love and kindness in our interactions with family, friends, co-workers and even strangers. In the second reading from the first letter of John, we are reminded of the depths of God's love for us. We are called children of God, beloved and cherished by our heavenly Father. and though we may not fully understand the mystery of this love we are invited to embrace it and live as children of light as followers of the good shepherd we are called to extend his love and compassion to those around us look for opportunities to be a blessing to others whether through acts of kindness words of encouragement or simply being present for someone in need when faced with difficult decisions or unclear paths turn to jesus in prayer seeking his wisdom and guidance trust that he knows what is best for you and will never lead you astray when you feel overwhelmed or anxious remember that jesus is always with you watching over you with loving care Take comfort in his presence and trust that he will never leave you nor forsake you. As we reflect on the image of good shepherd, let us ask ourselves, do we recognize the voice of our shepherd amidst the noise of the world? Do we trust in his guidance knowing that he leads us on the path of righteousness? And do we follow him with the same selflessness and sacrificial love with which he loved us we shall pause and reflect